All right, I want to welcome everybody back to the Motor Club of America training. Uh, this is part three, what to do when I get started. And if you guys watched one and two, um, now you're ready to promote your business, all right? So how to promote MCA. Starting out as a newbie, I, I highly would recommend starting out with your family and friends. Why? Because that's considered your warm market. People that you know, people that trust you, and people that like you, all right? And hopefully they trust you enough to do business with you, and hopefully they like you, okay? Um, either or, that's your warm market, and that's where you want to start. You'll find yourself probably uh, making your first sales with people that you know in your warm market, okay? So that's a great place to start um, to um, getting your information out there about your business, all right? Next, you want to have yourself a website or create your own website. Now, I'm pretty sure we can agree that the TVC Matrix website isn't all that sexy, okay? But it does give the information. It just gives bold information about our services and what we offer. But does that really give information about the company if people are doing their research? No, it doesn't. So you want to have your own website or at least create your own website. Uh, you can purchase a website from a lot of members um, in the company. Um, if you want information on that, you can email me and I can recommend um, some, some good uh, websites that you can purchase. All right, But you definitely want some sort of a um, website that people can go to and get the information that they need. Business cards and flyers. Now those are good to have when you want to pass out to certain people. Let's say you're at a networking event. Business cards are great to kind of um, give people uh, some sort of a, a, a word that, hey, you know, I got a new business. This is my number. This is my email address. My website is on here. Check it out. You know, business cards are great for networking. Let's say you work a job, okay? You probably just want to give out some business cards to your coworkers, you know? They may refer some other people to you. I mean, anything. You know, business cards go places where you don't go. So having some business cards and flyers are great ways to um, getting some traffic and um, getting some leads to your business. Now if you're just starting out, you may not be able to purchase any business cards or flyers. I would not worry about that. Please do not worry about business cards and flyers if you cannot purchase them, okay? Make a sale or two and then you know go back and, and, and get you some business cards and some flyers. But until then, you know, don't worry about the flyers and business cards. That's not a big deal. You can still promote your business very well without business cards and flyers. And last but not least, send your prospects to a presentation. Having some sort of presentation that people can go to and look at is a, is a wonderful way to get people to uh, get all the information that they need about your business. You're probably new and you don't know too much about the business or you don't know how to explain it. Well, find a good presentation to send them to so they can get all the information that they need to get started. Strategies and ways to promote MCA. Social networking, Facebook marketing, Twitter, Instagram, YouTube, and so much more. Social media is such a huge platform. And, you know, when you want to get people to take a look at your business... Um, a lot of people use these this social networking platform. You know, it's it's millions and millions of people on social network. Okay, Facebook is the number two busiest networking site, social networking site in the world, right behind Google. All right, so you have a lot of people that's just on Facebook alone, but it's so many different uh, platforms and social media that you can use. I mean, I couldn't even put them all on this page. Okay. So social networking is huge, and it's a great strategy um, to getting leads to your business. Content marketing. Blogging, article and content marketing, uh, video marketing, which is one of my favorites, and webinars. You know, those are other strategies that you can use to uh, generate leads in your business. Uh, you can get eyeballs on your business uh, by blogging, you know, video marketing, you know, putting yourself out there in front of people, uh, YouTube, things like that. Um, you know, I, I would definitely use one of these strategies and I would try my best to perfect them, at least one of them, as to, you know, getting started in my business, all right? Now, there's some ways that you can go about if you were looking at some paid marketing. 
I really would not recommend paid marketing if you're just getting started. I would stick to the free networking platforms um, and, and free ways to market my business if I'm just getting started, okay? Paid marketing is probably for someone who knows a little bit more about um, that platform, okay? So basically, guys, these are some strategies to get yourself started in the right direction. Um, this right here was part three of the uh, getting started training. And we will see you in the next video.